Hi, this video is to demonstrate how to use PDFs uh, that are on the internet and how to link specifically to particular pages within a PDF. Uh, so you can see across here, what I've got is a document that's on the internet. This is the syllabus for the IPT course that I teach. And you can see that when you use this URL, it's going to take you straight to the start of the PDF. Now, a traditional PDF, which is just stored on our website, all you would need to do is add a link at the end so I've just typed hash page equals and then you type in the page number that you want to jump to so if I want to link to page 42 then I would just add hash page equals 42 to the end of the link and that would then give me a URL which when I uh, copy that into a new tab and I paste it in that'll give me a URL that'll take me straight to page 42 of that PDF document which is stored on the internet now that works fantastic for normal PDFs, uh, just adding that hash page equals onto the end. However, if your PDF is stored in Google Drive, unfortunately that doesn't work. Uh, so what I'm going to do is show you a workaround and it's actually quite a good workaround because what it allows you to do is add some information to the PDF um, as your link. So um, what I'm going to do is simply have a look at this PDF which is stored in my Google Drive you would obviously need to share this in the normal way and then instead of giving them this link here what you would do is you would create a comment so let's say that I want to link them to exercise 9.1 and you can see I've got here a comment that I've added just by using the little plus comment bar there and so that's then created a comment and you can see that under the three dots you can link to this comment and so if I go there then I can copy that link say done and then when I get my new tab and I paste that link in instead of linking in the PDF to the cover page it's going to jump to the comment that's inside that PDF. Now this comment could be used to describe what you actually want the students to do or what information is at the P in the PDF at that point. And so that way you can actually have a link within your PDFs, or sorry, a link to a point within a PDF in Google Drive as well as just normal PDFs which are stored on the web. I uh, hope that video has helped you.